fam, what's good? Welcome to another video. This video is sponsored by Jay Santana. It is Anti-Love Song by Betty Davis with Larry Graham on bass. This song is simple, very simple, very hard, all at the same time. Like my head. So, it's in G minor. There's only two parts of the groove. Okay, the first part goes like this. So here's the first part of the groove. A lot of octave stuff happening, starting with F. We got the, we got the, the standard octave shape with the finger. We're only gonna concentrate on the fretting hand for right now, okay? And then I'll explain to you what's happening in my plucking hand. So my fretting hand, F to G. And then you're gonna jump all the way up to this G. Now you could you could spend some time uh, practicing that and getting getting comfortable with that. One, two, three, four. Three, four. Three, four. One and two, three, four. And two. Okay. So in the right hand, well, my plucking hand, which happens to be my right hand. Um, I'm doing the, what I call the pinch with the forefinger and thumb. Okay. And I'm, you know, notice I'm kind of over the front pickup, thumb parallel, and it's just a pinch like that. Um, my fingers on my right hand do kind of su support me a little bit on that hand. But they're not tucked all the way under. That's that's the main thing. So here's the next part. Um, just octave on the F. Open E, hammer back down to F. Sorry, sloppy. Okay, this is a motion I kind of do. Uh, Do a pluck and then slide down to an octave. Well, this one is sliding up. So let's put those two parts together. One, two, three, four. Two, three, four. That was sloppy. Three, four, two, three, four. Okay, that's the main A section. There's, uh, I will call it a B part. Um, I can't remember how many bars before you get to this, but it's tricky. It's simple and it's tricky all at the same time. And muting is a problem. I literally just learned this about uh, 30, 40 minutes ago. Muting is something that you're going to really have to, to pay attention to. So it goes like this. That's the first part of this. That whole minor 7 or minor pentatonic. G, B 
flat. Sliding into the D from C. Okay. And I'm playing this part over and over and over again so that you can see it's going to take some repetition. It's going to take some getting used to. That's the tricky part because you really got to mute on this. Three, four. So that part is... That's where the muting. So let me do that real slow and show you where the where the muting becomes tricky. So right there, I'm all of a sudden now trying to mute the A and the E string with my palm. All right, it's quick, so you're not going to be able to. I don't think you're going to be able to mute them completely. There's going to be there's bound to be some noise, but it's definitely something that you're going to have to look at. So, two, three, four. Two, getting better. Four. So here we've got... twice so you can see if you watch if you watch my right hand I'm really moving a little bit to try to mute those other strings So I, what's becoming natural for me is to just come come down a little bit, just a little bit with my palm on the A and D. I'm sorry, E and A string. So So repetition, repetition, because I was sucking at this a little while ago and I'm getting better at it. Um, you know, it's a tricky little part. Simple-ish song, tricky part. So I'm gravitating towards one when it's really I did it again. So it's just a repetition thing. Uh, the hardest part I found was that time I, I took my hand off a little bit to see what happened. Um, two, easy to play. Two, three. 
there's there's some there's some noise there. It's not totally quiet, but it it isn't it isn't necessarily ringing all over the place either. If I think about Larry Graham's style, um, I imagine that maybe he plucked it a little bit harder and a little bit wider uh, off the off the instrument. Woo! Three, four. Maybe. That's a lot of ringing. So I'm still. Uh, so that is anti love song. If you dig this content, go on and subscribe to the channel. You can support by joining the membership or signing, uh, uh, buying any one of the products down below. I thank you for your time. I'll see you. Thank you, Jay Santana, for sponsoring this video. I'll catch y'all in the next video. Peace, two things.